Hey everyone, so for today's video we're going to be learning a very simple, very common, and very useful phrase. Okay? Mo he. Okay? M sound, u, o. So if you haven't watched or if you need to review, go back and watch one of my very first videos about the vowels. It's really good. <laughs> so, M sound, right? So, mu, if you take out that, so just like that, it's mu. If you take this part out, it's mo, right? If you put the combination of vowels together with the M sound, it sounds like mo, mo, okay? Mu, mo. H sound, a, i, he, okay? Try it. Mo he, mo he, mo he, mo he. You try. <gasps> Very good. <laughs> mo he. So mo means what? He means to do or doing whatever, right? So combined it means what are you doing? Mo he. What are you doing? So you can see that's commonly used when you're texting, starting a conversation, right? So it's like, hey, what are you up to? Hey, mo he, mo he. Okay. Now, with any phrase, there's lots of variations, right? So if you want to be a little bit more polite, you can say mo he yo, right? Remember, if you add that yo, mo he yo. It's a little bit more polite. You can do mo ha se yo. That's even more polite, right? Mo ha se yo. <laughs> mo ha se yo. So that's like super polite. What are you doing? Mo ha se yo. You can even sometimes hear wohani. What are you doing? So that's really informal. You're not really gonna use that that much. Just stick with this. If you want to be informal, just this is the best way to go. Mohe, what are you doing? Now, sometimes you can hear or see a slang version of this, right? Because you know when people are texting, you know instead of saying hey, what is up. People say, what's up, or sup, <laughs> sup, <laughs> right? So instead of spelling it out like this, mohe, you might see, mohe, okay? So what happens is, instead of typing the o, the o and the u, right? So mo. If you say it fast enough over and over, mo 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 mo, right? <laughs> so instead of saying mo with the u o, some people, if you're using slang, they say mo, okay, with the o. Mo, mo he. You'll see that a lot. You might hear it like that. Um, but just remember, the correct way is mo. Okay, no matter what, correct way is mo. But you can use mo if it's slang, right? Mo he, they mean mo he. Okay. So if you're asking a question, right? So after you say, oh mo he, what are you doing? Right? Our bonus word. Here we go. Ellipsis. Okay. K nyam. G sound u n sound ya ng. Okay. K nyam. This means 
just so somebody says bohe kenyang ku nyang ku nyang nyang ku nyang this means just just you see that just right bohe kenyang i'm just chilling right I'm just here. Kunyang. Just. So that's our bonus word. Kunyang. Now, if you want to make plans, you can say. Mo. Hal. Mo hal. Ka. Remember the double consonants? If you haven't watched it or if you need to review, that's also, I hear, that's another good video. Mohan <laughs> ka. Mohan ka. Ka. Mohan ka. This means, what should we do? What should we do? Mohan ka. Let me make more space. Mohan ka. Okay, what should we do? Do they have like thicker Expo marker? I need to get some thicker ones. So, mohale. That means, what do you, what do you want to do? Mohale. Mohale. Okay, that means, what do you want to do? Mohale. Mohale. M sound, U, O. H sound, A. L sound. L sound, A, E. Mohale. Hale. Okay, mohale, what do you want to do? Mohalka, mohale, mohago shippo. All these variations, right? But for today, just remember, mohe. Okay, what are you doing, mohe? So your homework for today, for this week, text somebody, mohe. <laughs> See if they respond kunyang. Okay? M sound u o h sound a e. Mohe. Alright? Very good.